What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. You guys, shout out to my client, Nikki, a top producing real estate agent in the state of Texas, um, just ready to take her brand, her business, and all the above um, to social media, more specifically Facebook advertising, Instagram advertising. And so if you've been following me for a while, you guys, one thing I really put on this channel is really kind of day in the life, um, tutorials, trainings, conference calls, training calls, um, either I'm in the in the in the ads manager setting up ads for myself or i'm helping clients um do it for them you know i'm, I'm helping them do it for themselves really we're just sharing screens and, and i'm walking them through you know certain things to click on when it comes to facebook ads and landing page software so if you've been following me Facebook ads, landing page software, email automation. Um, that's kind of what I put out on this channel. And it's really that simple, right? If you're building an online business, these are the basic tools you need. You need, you need traffic, right? So for the past few, few years, it's been Facebook. It's been, it's been YouTube. It's been Instagram advertising. As, as these platforms and as social media kind of scale even further, there's going to be many, many opportunities, many traffic opportunities to start learning how to, how to run these ads. But for the past few years, I've been mastering Facebook ads. And so that's one real super important tool that you, or skill, I should say, that if you're a small business owner, you want to learn, you want to learn paid traffic, or you just simply delegate it to somebody else, right? Um, and then the second thing is landing page software. So as people see your advertisement, whatever you're putting out there, and this applies for organic posting as well. Many, many people will put out organic posts. You're building a business, you're just posting all over social media, but there's really no call to action. There's no link. There's nowhere to take them. There's nowhere to capture the lead. There's nowhere to make a sell. That's the landing page software that is so crucial to an online business. So what I do is when I, when I onboard coaching clients for Facebook advertising, I also refer and recommend different software. And whether, whether it's ClickFunnels, whether it's Kartra, whether it's Kartra or, or really, to tell you the truth, those are the only two damn softwares that I recommend is either, is either ClickFunnels or Kartra. But when it comes to my clients, what I do is I put them on Kartra because with Kartra, it's all in one. It's the landing page software, it's the email autoresponder, and it's the online calendar. So if you're, in the, if you're in the client services business where you're a real estate agent, you're an insurance agent, you're, you're um. You're any type of business, any type of business that 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 appointments are are crucial, right? Where you you kind of you live and die by by getting people to schedule an appointment with you. Uh, you're you're an agency owner, right? You're running ads for the clients, whatever it may be. If you're in the client services business. A calendar, an online calendar is super, super important to give people the ability to just, to just click and schedule a call. That's why I recommend Kartra because it's all in one, the landing page, the email automation, and the online calendar. So with Nikki being a, being a top producing real estate agent, we're going to be running ads to her local area and, and directing people to download a seller guide. And, and so as that person clicks on the ad, they need to be able to go to a page, enter their name and email, go into some type of email autoresponder and then also have the ability to schedule an appointment with her. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to simply walk her through the setup of Kartra, um, the online software that I'm recommending. And I wanted to kind of share that with you guys and, and kind of just give you my two cents as I kind of go through it and help her set it up. So let me let me get Nikki on the line. And um, hope you guys get value from this from this video. And if you guys are new, subscribe. My name is David. I'm out here in San Diego building a social media agency for the past few years, and that kind of branched out to digital mark or to digital courses and 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 most importantly, affiliate marketing. And that's the biggest biggest thing with 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 software like this, you guys. If you're in the client services business and you're recommending software, recommend software that's going to pay you a monthly commission. And that's what Karch has been able to do for me and my family is pay me a recurring income every single month by simply referring people to get on it. So let me help Nikki get, get aboard on board with Kartra. And again, take note, you guys, and I hope you guys subscribe and comment below if you guys are new. See you soon. Hold on. Okay, awesome. So this kind of just brings us to a demo, but you can just scroll down and then just, um, you'll see a yellow button, start your trial. Okay, perfect. And then over here, these are the different packages, but you don't, you won't, you don't need any of this to the right. So silver, gold, platinum, you don't need any of that. You'll just go with the starter for now. Um, and then you'll, you'll toggle. I think you got to toggle, go back up real quick, scroll back up real quick. Yeah. This is the monthly side. Okay, cool. So stay on the monthly. Actually, do you have to click on monthly? See if you have to click on monthly right there. Yeah. Click on monthly. Okay. Yeah, cool. It's already on it. Awesome. So scroll down and we're going to go to the left. So all we're going to do is a 14 day trial. 
for the starter. So just start my trial. And then I always tell people to, to kind of justify, right. To justify the, 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 the monthly, the $99. I always tell, tell my clients, the way you want to kind of look at this is you have me. Like, I don't want to toot my own horn, but you have me. Like, I'm going to transfer all these funnels to you for free. I'm going to be able to support you on all this stuff for free. Whenever you need help with any of the stuff, you got me for free. So kind of look at that as well. So it's not just $99 for some freaking software. It's, it's really for David as well, because I'm going to help you succeed and just help you crush the, you know, crush, crush this. So email yeah, the here. Other, the other CRM I signed up for is like 69 a month and it doesn't offer the landing page. I don't think so. Oh, not at all. Not, not only that, but, it, but for sure, no one-on-one -on -one support by, you know, by any of them. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, yeah. So I'm going to be available for whenever we need to talk about this and then we have a we have a, a facebook group with i think we just passed twenty thousand people in that facebook group which as we as we go through this setup um you'll see a link to join the facebook group so yeah so let's let's join this let, let's set this up and then we'll be able to join that group um what do you want to put on company you you can leave it blank or you could just put sold by nikki b whatever like it doesn't actually yeah put sold by nikki b that's fine And then whatever name you put right there in the username sold by Nikki B, you can never, you can't change that name. So yeah, that, that's fine to rock with from this point on. And no one's going to see that link anyways. That, that is the default link. So your Karch domain nickname, that's the default link. But what we're going to do is we're going to integrate our domain to, to replace that link. So you'll have all the pages that we start to build will be your actual sold by Nikki B.com. But it'll just be directing to that link so the general public won't even see that that link at the top yeah, so as you go through here just hit the drop down and you'll see a bunch of different options so i don't know what the purpose of these what the reason for these questions are because it's 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 one software for all it's not like they cater it towards whatever you answer like whatever your answer is I don't even know what this part, why this part's even important, but yeah, try to, I guess, put whatever. Okay, cool. So we'll just fill out those basic questions, go to next. And then on the next page, we should be in. Okay. So now this is just like a little thank you, but you can scroll down and then just put, put no thanks. So you can just uncheck the yes. Yeah. Uncheck that. We don't need any of this stuff. So you could just scroll down. Or actually just scroll down you should see a link below to just skip it so no thanks yeah perfect so click on that one no thanks and then now congratulations welcome to kartra and then we scroll down and then then we'll just follow a few of these steps right here so check your inbox so make sure you yeah check your inbox just as what they emailed you is your link to log in but we're going to be able to click here and log in um but yeah you definitely got an email so scroll down so we'll go to step two so oh. Yeah, so the, so there's your email, perfect. And then access your card, your account. So you can you can click on that button, and then um, that will open up. Yeah, so go ahead and click on the blue button. It should open up a new window. And what I want you to do is bookmark this page. So let's let's bookmark this page. Maybe even put it in your your FB Business Manager or if or wherever. I don't care, but just so you know where it's at. Obviously, so add bookmark. Um, so that's what like I always stress, Nikki. Like Facebook ads. Kartra, like that's all you need to take over your area. Like that's it to capture leads, take over your local area. That's it. So if you went all in and just focused on these two, like we'll, we'll crush it. Um, Do I need so, to <clears throat> go to that email before I log in? No, you can log in now, but go back to that tab. Let's, let's go back to that tab. Cause I want you to, um, there's a couple more. There's Here. a couple. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So step three. Okay. So there's tutorials. Um, which is a bunch of training videos, but again, I want to, I want to be able to train you. I'll be able to jump on any call. And then I have a ton of emails. So here's what happens. Like, like, just like, just like our whole strategy with you is to run ads, get people to click and download your seller guide. Once they download that seller guide, they're now in your email automation where every other day we want to start sending them automated emails. So in this case with you, what did you just do? You just clicked on my link and you just jumped into my world. So now what I have set up on the back end is a handful of emails that are now going to start going out every other day to Nikki. And these emails that I have set up are just basic 
trainings, like little videos that I put together, teaching you different parts of this platform. And those are all automated emails. So there, the view Karcher not training, there's a ton of videos that you can, you can watch those as well. But again, I have a ton of videos coming your way that you'll be able to learn from. So step four, get world. Okay. So we don't need that one. Let's see. Step five should be our Facebook group. Okay, cool. So click on that one and join that group. And then once you click on join, it'll ask you which email you used. And so just um, put that email in and then you should be good. And then you'll, you should get accepted within the next, within the next hour. Perfect. So we just requested access to the group. Now we can log in. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of just walk you through um, really what's so important over here. So uh, yeah, I agree. And then you could just put, okay, I want oh, video. your brand new Kartra account. I just click on continue. Before you start, let's take. And then let the Kartra experience begin. Okay, cool. So this is the dashboard. So here's what's, here's what I, what I really want to focus in on again, because as we start to build this out, and as we're just getting started for the, you know, for the first time, I know budget is everything. That's why I want to always try to justify this $99 a month. This is what it really is going to come down to are these three basic tools, these three most important tools that you're, that, that justify it. And to the left, it starts with my communications. So in my communications, that's your CRM. That's where you're, where all these leads are going to be coming in. So click on my communications to the left. So as all these leads start to come in, you'll start to see a huge list of every lead right here. But then what I do is I click on list right there at the top, click on list, and that will allow me to look at each individual list. So my seller, my seller guide list, my buyer guide list, my, my, my open house list, my general list, whatever, like you'll be able to create all these different lists of, of different, of different leads. And the way I kind of structure this, it's really based on the funnel. So if I have an open house funnel, okay, cool. People that lock, people that opt into that open house, that lead will land on that list. My <clears throat> funnel, anyone that comes in, that lead will be on this list. So here you'll see all the list um, laid out right here as we start to as we start to build out the communications. Hover over communications at the top, right above tags, and right here communications. The broadcast that's a a broadcast a broadcast email is a one is a one off email like a one time email. Like for example, like let's say some like just news flash or, or or the market changes or some type of update, and you want to just randomly send a send an email to your list. That's a broadcast. So you can just come in here. You can you can you can set up an email and you can send it to whoever. You can send it to. Okay, so that's like a bulk email. That's a bulk email that can go to a specific list. It doesn't have to go to every lead. It can I can I can segment it so I can only send it to people that are in my seller guide funnel. Okay. Right. Like I can I can I can I can. For sure. And it's so simple. Like once I show you, how to do this, this is so simple, but yeah, that's a, that's a broadcast. That's a, that's a one-time bulk email. And then the sequences, the sequences, that's our drip. So that's our email automation. So that's what we've been talking about this whole time. When people opt in every other day, they need to receive another email. That's the sequences. So I'm going to help you set all that up. That's, that's one whole call right there. Just, just the, the sequences alone. Um, to make sure that these emails are, are going out every other day or every day. Some people like to send an email every day. I kind of like to send one out every other day. Um, just so I'm not really, really bugging that person. But I know I know a lot of people that do it daily and they're super successful. But that's sequences. And then the automations, I'll, I'll, I'll teach you about automations later. <clears throat> but um, it's really just, it's my communications for my leads. And as I put these leads in, I can, I can put notes on all these leads, which I'll show you how to do. So you can, you can get very detailed with notes on each lead. And this is all in my communications. And then the analytics, the analytics, you can see everything in real time. So I can see what lead clicked on an email. I can see if that lead opened an email. I can see if that lead even clicked and downloaded my seller guide. So analytics, I can track everything in real time on what that lead is doing, like what pages are on, what emails are opening, what email they did not open. That's all through my analytics. So, so normally my communications to have an email list, to have an email autoresponder, most email autoresponders, they, they range anywhere from anywhere from 30 to, to a hundred dollars a month just for the email autoresponder. And so trust me when I'm talking about this, like online marketing is my space. I know most softwares out there and they're all individual softwares. Most people spend just on the email auto automation alone. So all that is, is here. So that's my communications. 
Then the, the second one that's so, so important is my pages. So in my pages to the left, that's where we're going to start building out these landing pages. So here, the good thing is, is that I already have a lot of these funnels done for you. And we're going to keep it super simple so we can, you know, get off to a fast start. But in my pages, you can click on the, the green one to the right. So if you click on that, that plus sign here, you can come in here. And what I love about this is that all the templates are already done. So click on squeeze pages. Squeeze pages is your landing page. So I can come over here and I can grab any of these templates and use that as my landing page. I can change out the color. I can change out the video slot, the image. I can change out the headline, but the template is already there. And that's what's so, so important because I'm not a web designer. Like I don't know, how to, I couldn't, I, at this point I could, I could freaking do this stuff in my sleep, but in the beginning, like if you told me to go create a website, like, hell no, like, I don't know how to do that. But if you gave me a template, I can work around that template. I can edit that headline and put my name, like I can do that. And that's what's so stupid simple about this is that the template is already there. So, so in no time, you're going to be, you're going to be able to do this stuff on your own. Like you're going to be able to create these basic pages on your own. It's that simple. So yeah. all these templates are done. So this is, this is what, what we call typically the, the landing page and, and like watch, for example, click hover over any of them and just click on preview. So not only can I change anything about it, anything about it, but I can also delete. So scroll back up. It's a, it's actually at the top. Oh. I can delete whatever I want as well. So the logo, your logo, I could take that part out. The yellow button, I could take that part out. Like, so I can change anything on the template that I want, you know, but, but the good thing is what I'm, what I really want you to understand is that you really don't need to, the template is what it is. That's already a proven converting. It's already a high converted page. So you don't have to really change anything about it, but just make it your own, change out that image, change that yellow button to red, like basic things like that. So you don't have to worry about really flipping the whole thing over, just do some basic editing. So the squeeze page, that's really what we call landing page. Some people call it an opt-in page. That's your, that's your squeeze page. And then video sales pages. What I like to do with video sales pages is like, for example, you're now in my world. You clicked on my link. Now you're with me with, in, inside of Kartra. Now you're going to start receiving emails over the next few days with, with videos from me teaching you how to use Kartra. Um, and when you when and these are all emails, when you start to receive these emails, you'll notice that there's a link in that email. Hey, Nikki, this is David. Hey, on today's training video, I'm going to be showing you how to put together a Kartra calendar. Click here to see my tutorial. As you click in that email, as you click, what I do is I, is I have them go to one of these pages. So it's a video sales page. You'll click, watch, hover over that top one, the red one or the pink one or whatever, just click on preview. So as you get my email, you click, I'm then taking you to a page like this, where all I did is I changed out the headline, video training on, Kartra, on the Kartra calendar. And then boom, I just put my video right there. And then, and then in my case, that red button down there, for example, get the full system for only 99. My button will say, like maybe, in, like, like maybe for example, in my video, I'll say, hey guys, and by the way, if you need more help with this, click the button below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule a, a call. Okay. Right. So I can, so, so again, I can change the red. I can change out the headline. I can, I can delete that entire top. This is a, this is a, a limited offer only in that clock. I can delete that and I can just keep it a clean headline video and a button and that button goes straight to my calendar so in a lot of my videos so again that's 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 the kind of business we're in you and i we're, we're in the very similar business where it's all about appointments so as your emails go out and as i really teach how to, how to, how to structure all this a person's downloading your seller guide two days later they're getting another email so as we really break out and as we really start to do video eventually down the line that could be a cool video. So, so let's say it's email number three. Hey, John, this is Nikki. Just wanted to follow up. Hey, in, in, in today's video, I'm giving you a seller tip that I really give all my clients when it comes to selling their property. Click here to watch my, my two-minute video on what, I tell, on what I tell all my clients. That's an email. <clears throat> Click. They come straight over here. They see a simple video. It could be a one-minute video. And hey, guys, by the way, if you have any questions, I'd love to talk to you. Click the button below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your best time. And these are just basic pages that I have set up in all of my, not all of my emails, but let's just say a few of them, where the whole objective is to, yeah, continue to educate them on what it takes to sell, 
but most importantly, have that button where they can click and schedule a call. Right. Because at the end of the day, we're all trying to get people on the on, on, on the phone. Right. So that's just an example. Like I use I use video sales pages in my in my emails um, for sure. And, and that's something, you know, we can we can definitely dive into later on. Um, thank you pages. Thank you pages is the thank you page. So click on thank you page. So as someone comes to your squeeze page, they opt in. They then land on the thank you page. And that's what we kind of spent time, you know, talking about over the last few calls is the thank you page. That's the, these are different templates of, of, of the thank you page. And it's really just squeeze page, thank you page. All these other pages you really don't need, need right now, right now. Um, so I don't want to overwhelm you with all this information. It's really squeeze page and thank you pages where, where on really what you'll ever need. But again, I have, I have them already done for you. So I'll just go to transfer them quick. But there's all, there's just all kinds of different templates, long sales pages, coming soon, product page. So you really don't need any of those other ones. So but they're there in case you ever want to play around with them. So hit cancel. So again, it's my communications, it's my pages. And then in your case, it's my calendar, those three tools. So again, typically those three tools are separate monthly softwares from three different companies. And that's why I use Kartra because those main three are all in this one. Um, so click on, click on my calendars, click on my calendars. And so this is, this is where we'll spend, and that's one whole call as well, because that, that, this is, yeah, that's one whole call where we'll spend. So over the next few days, over the next few days, we're going to spend time on setting up your, your email sequence, which is under my communications. And then we'll spend time editing your pages on a whole nother call. And then on a whole different call, let's say a third call, we'll spend time setting up the calendar. And it's really those three main tools. So what I'm going to do really, really quick is I'm going to transfer and I can transfer all these funnels over to you, but I don't want to, again, overwhelm you. Let's, let's start with the seller guide one. Let me send over the seller guide one, and then I'll show you how to, how to, how to um, implement it into your account. Give me one second. Okay, let me know if you can see it now. Can you see my? Okay, yeah. Okay, cool. So over here on the left, my campaigns. So let me, let me show you what I already have. Actually, and you know what? Let me show you another part too. Because not only do I have funnels done, but Kartra does too. Okay, so not, not only do I have funnels already done for you, these are already done. The seller guide funnel, open house listing, these are already done for you. But also Kartra has so many different funnels as well. So I can come over here to my campaigns to the left, available campaigns, and Kartra has all these different funnels. And again, you, you probably won't need any of this anytime soon, but I'm just kind of showing you the, the added benefits of, of this stuff. It's already done. Like all I got to do is just deploy the campaign and I have an entire funnel already done for me. All I got to do is just go in there and edit the headline, change the color, put my image, basic stuff. So this is super powerful because people charge thousands of dollars to create this type of stuff for you. And it's all here for us, all, all part of our, our membership. So here's what I have. I have my campaign. So all I'm going to do here is I'm going to hit these three dots. I'm going to click on share. And then over here, I can just get a simple share code and then I'll show you how to import it. So I'll get general share code, this code right here. Okay, cool. So now in the Zoom chat, I'm gonna send you this code in the Zoom chat and then go ahead and, and share your screen. And I'll show you where to put that. Okay, cool. So now, we're going to click on my campaigns to the left, just copy that, that code, and then my campaigns to the left. And can you open the screen more? Can you um, expand the, um, the window? Yeah, cool. Okay, awesome. Perfect. Okay, cool. So now all we're going to do is we're going to, we clicked on my campaigns, and then we're going to click it, we're going to go to the top and we're going to click on available campaigns. And then again, here's all the ones that Kartra already has, but I'm going to give you this one. So click on import. So we're going to click on that green import. And all you're going to do is paste in that code and then hit next. So again, in the future, as you really scale your business, like this is stuff you can offer your team. Like this is crazy. Like this saves people so much time. So here's what's coming over with it. Four pages. And the four pages is page one is, is the squeeze page, the landing page. And then the second page is the thank you page. 
And then the third page is the thank you for scheduling. So as people go to your calendar and they put Tuesday at 4 p.m., they end up going to a, a confirmation page, which is a thank you for scheduling page. That's the third page. And then a fourth page is just a simple um, video sales page that I put in there just for emails. As we put out emails, you can always use that page for, for emails. So that's the pages. And then the tags, I'll explain the tags later, the calendar, the list, the form, and then the sequence. So that's all what's coming over. So hit the green one, begin import. And then over here, campaign successfully imported. So go ahead and close this out. Um, and then what we're going to do, there is the campaign. What we have to do now is we have to click on the deploy campaign. So we just imported it. Now we're going to deploy it. So the prefix, just, just put it, put NB just to brief, just put your initials and you'll be able to, you're going to edit that later, but, and then import. So now everything is coming over and I'll show you exactly where that's at. So it's, in fact, it's going to be exactly where I showed you. So my communications, my pages, my calendars, that's where we're going to see everything. Okay. So now click on my communications to the left. Now we'll see if we click on list right there at the top. And all this is is just a basic, a basic list. And, and as leads come in, that's where the leads go. They go onto that list. Um, it's telling you where they came from. Telling you exactly where they came from. Yes. And so if you hit the pencil to the right, go ahead and hit the pencil. And let's just now, now you can just rename it. You can completely rename it. You could take away the NB. You can completely give it a, a completely different name if you wanted to. Um, the public description, that is whenever, like, whenever you go to unsubscribe from anyone's email list, it gives you a brief description of what list that was, what list you were even on. And so that's all that is, is as people, because people, some people will unsubscribe, like you and I, we unsubscribe from stuff all the time, like, right, like I, at least I do, a lot of junk email that come my way, I'll unsubscribe. And so as I do, it just kind of, there's a little description. So that's all that is. Thank you for downloading my seller guide, just to kind of give them a reminder of how they even got on that list. Okay, so hit edit. So that's the list. And then now if you hover over communications at the top and then click on sequences, there is the sequence. So this sequence, we're going to spend a whole, in fact, let me have you just go into it just so I can show you, but we'll spend a whole call on just setting up that. Hit the pencil to the right, um, the edit. So here you can take away the NB if you wanted to. Um, so as these people come into the funnel, they're on the list and they're in the sequence. The sequence is your email autoresponder. So click on edit. And so now I'll kind of just give you a brief tutorial of this, but again, we'll spend, we'll spend a lot of time on this. So just hit, hit start tutorial and then just go through, just, yeah, scroll down, scroll down and then just keep hitting next. And this is just kind of giving you, giving you just a, a, a tutorial of what each little thing is, but I'm going to, I'm going to just give you a crash course once we're in, because it's really, it's really pretty more basic than this explanation. So let's get started. And then, so now here's what came over. So again, as that person opts in immediately, there's that email that goes out. You're 20, we're going to do some editing because it, you know, all the verbiage, I want it to be in your, in your, in your verbiage, like in your, you know, in your, in your words, but the template's there, like the template is there. So the moment that person opts in, that email is going to trigger right away. And so that's why, as I was explaining a couple of days ago on our, on actually on our last few calls, as that person opts in and they come to the thank you page, that video, the four bullet points, thanking them. Thank you so much for downloading my 2022 seller guide. My name is Nikki, right? So number one, I'm thanking them. Number two, I'm introducing myself. Number three, I'm telling them to check their email because I just emailed their PDF. And that's why I'm able to say it in the video because this thing shoots it right away. So the moment they're watching my 45 second video, that email is already in their, in their inbox because it went out immediately the moment they opted in. And it's all based on that starting rule. So hit that green hover over that green starting rule and just click on edit. So here we could tell the system really anything like, Whoever subscribes to this list, so whoever just opted in is going to continue to receive these emails. Or I can go on a tag, or if it was a product that I sold them, or if it was just an opt-in form. But list is really typically the most easiest one. So once they opt in, they're subscribed to that list. That's who's going to continue to receive these emails. So hit save. And so it's all about that starting role. And so now immediately that first one goes out. 
And then I, and then you can always change the timestamp. So two days later, real estate 101, two days later, like, so if you just go down two days later, another, that third one, any questions I can answer two days later, the cost of selling your home and all this stuff you're going to edit. Like we can, this is just a basic template that I put, put together. And then here, are you on Facebook? So now, now I'm trying to get them to engage with me on Facebook, maybe put a link to our business page and say, Hey, if you're ever on Facebook, click here and message me. Or maybe even become friends with them on Facebook. I, I'm going to show you how to just put your, your link to maybe your personal profile. You know, it'd be cool to have a ton of people that are coming into this funnel that we're running ads to. They all live locally. And now I'm directing them to my personal profile to connect with me there. Like that's powerful. Like that's super powerful. So these emails, I can direct them to wherever I want because I'm going to put that link. So for example, hover over the, the dots and let's let's go into one of them. What's and again, the three dots next to any of those emails. So you see those three dots next to two oh, days. Okay. Yeah. So click on edit. And so as we go in, this is really, this is like the settings of it. Um, the delay. So the delay, I can wait two days. I can wait one day. I can wait one hour. I can wait five days. I can change the delay and have that email go out whenever. Um, the day and time I can, I can, I can, Typically, like, for example, it's set for two days. That two days is obviously based on a 24-hour, you know, day. So the day and time, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, sometimes people only, sometimes people like sending emails only during the day. The way this, this is set up, it's wait two days. So if it's set up that way and someone opts into your funnel at 11 p.m., two days later at 11 p.m., that person's going to get another email. Sometimes people don't like that, right? So, so if anything, in day and time, hit the hit the pencil to the right. You can always change. So even if they even if they opt in at midnight, that next email, I can choose to only send during the day. Okay. Right, because if I don't do that, then they're going to get emails at midnight every two days, right? So, so this is something we'll probably want to want to want to want to configure and, and just do or between and, and maybe just put daytime hours, right? So they can just start receiving these emails during, during the day. So that's all preference. It's totally up to you, but that's kind of, that's kind of a, a better idea than, than just leaving it. Um, because again, I don't want them getting, because you're going to have people opt in at random hours, like random hours. Cause again, as ads go out, you're running Facebook ads, Instagram ads, like people are online freaking 24 seven and these ads are running, are running really 24 seven. So again, people are going to see your ads at off hours and maybe we'll, you know, switch this out once we get here, but we'll spend time on this, you know, down the line. So hit X out of this one. And so now it brings us, it, so go back into those three dots real quick. So on any of them, click on the three dots, go back to edit. So we have the, um, the delay, we have the day and time. We have, yeah, the delay, the day and time, the communication, that's simply the title of the email. So whatever I want to put in the subject line, that's what I put there in the communication. And then the gateway, what we, what we need to do, do you have an, do you have an actual business email, not a Gmail, but do you have an actual, like, like, like info at soulbynickyb.com? Like, do you have an actual professional email like that? Like a business email? No. Um, that girl that was going to quote unquote, build my website with that GoDaddy. Okay. She was going to set up through GoDaddy. Okay. She was good. Like, I don't know if she did, or if she was going to set up the email part of it. Well, that you can do that once what you can do that as long as you have a domain through GoDaddy, which, which you do, but that's, that's not expensive at all. I think it's like a couple bucks a month. I think it's like two bucks a month to have, to have your email, to, to take that domain and also turn it into your email. And that's what you want to do. You for sure want that because if, if sold by Nikki B.com is what we're branding, then, then, then I need that email as well. Right. I want that email as well because that's part of my branding. So we'll eventually get that email for sure. I was going to say she did create it, but I don't remember. Okay. We'll, we'll find out, but that's what the gateway is. So we'll have to put in an actual business email there and we'll get back to this part. So we'll, we'll for sure play around with this um, on our next few calls. And then the recipients, so it, can't, it can't be the, 
the Gmail? No, not at all. And, and that's how all email autoresponders are. You have to have, and that's why she was probably trying to set it up for you because she knows also that, yeah, once you go this route and, and get some type of email autoresponder, you're going to need that business email because that, that's the email that reflects on, on the email. So as people get emails, they see that business email rather than a Gmail, you know, so, so we'll get, we'll get back to that for sure. And the recipients is subscribed to that list, the split test off email content. So now go hit that pencil to, on the email content. So this is the actual email. So as we come in, here's what's so cool about this and so basic is that again, there's a template, but you're going to want to change a lot of this stuff. You can change out the headline, the cost of selling your home. We can completely rename everything. Um, but if you scroll down, there's all the text. There's all the text. There's all the text. There's a link. Click here to schedule your best time. That could be a link, which what we call that is a hyperlink. So when you just take any word and hyperlink it and you put a link behind it, that's what that is. Click here to schedule your best time. So I just hyperlink that. Um, but that could have also been a button. Click here to schedule your best time. That could have also been the same button that they saw on my thank you page. Right. So that yellow button on the thank you page or that red button on the thank you page, I could I could also put it there. And and, and that's what I kind of will recommend once we get here and I start teaching this part more is we'll kind of want to keep the same branding, whatever our color is, our color theme, like whatever button color we're using, we're going to use that same for all, just like we're using your same social media username for all basic branding like this stuff, basic branding like this, most people just just overlook and it's so, so important. So. We'll get back to this part, but what I wanted to show you was the design templates. So right there at the top left, click on design templates. So this, all this is, is a template. There's the text, there's the image at the bottom. Watch, scroll, scroll all the way to the bottom real quick. You got the you note know, to the right on the text. Oh. If you scroll down, you have the image and then you have the social media icons. All this is, is a simple template, but to the left. So go back up to the left, to the left, I can either build out my own template or I can use one of Karcher's templates. So scroll up, go to um, full templates. So right here, we're in design templates. We're in full templates. I can scroll down and I can use any of these templates. Mm -hmm. And it's just like building a page, just like the, the page templates where I can use a page template and I can just delete or, or yeah, get rid of whatever I don't want. So right here, I can get rid of, watch, let's, let's play around with it real quick. Click on any of them, click and drag it over. So all we're doing is clicking and dragging it over, but drag it up to the top. So scroll up to the, on this email. Yeah, scroll it. Yeah. So click and put it above. Hey, first name. Drop your block in. the Yeah, right there. So I could just boom, create my own template and, 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 and I can I can put my logo, obviously attach all those social media icons. I can put images of properties. I can put my own image, whatever. And then I can delete. So if I don't want that, I can just X out and just get rid of that slot. So this right here, what I always tell people is, is, is yeah, find out whatever template you want to roll with. And once you, once you optimize it, meaning you put your logo, you, you, you set up those social media icons. We, we, we connect the button to your calendar. So right here, the button at the bottom, sign up for your sign up for more information that could be click here to schedule your free call. Right? So once we optimize it, we only need to do that once. And then we save as template and we can use that same template over and over and over again, which saves us a ton of time. And not only is that important for branding, but yeah, it saves you a ton of time. Um, so we'll definitely get back into this part for sure. Um, but that's the power of this. That's how simple this is, is just drag and drop and then, and then just do your basic editing. Like that button, hover over the button. Don't click, but just hover over the button and hit the pink pencil. So if I go into the button, there's the URL. So I can put my calendar link or I can even link them. What I do a lot is I'll link them to my video. Like, then that's what I do a lot is I'll either send out emails to get appointments for sure. But then also like, for example, today, once you and I are done with this call, I'm going to be sending out a broadcast promoting my new YouTube video that I just released an hour ago. And in my email, that button will have a link, the URL to my YouTube video. And so I could put right there at the top where it says copy, I could take away that text. It says sign up for watch, take away, delete that above. Yeah, right there. 
So in my case, what I would do there is I'm going to put click here to watch my newest YouTube video, right? And then they click. You could put click here to schedule your best time, you know, um, and then I can change out that color. Um, but yeah, type anything right there. Wow. Okay. And yeah. Then yeah. And then I can change the color to whichever, you know, whatever. And so again, what I'm saying is whatever we're doing, whatever color, whatever, whatever, um, yeah, in this case, yeah, whatever color, whatever template we want to, we're going to be able to save it and just use the same one over and over and over. That way our branding, you know, stays consistent. Mm -hmm. Right. So, so yeah, so that, that is super, super powerful. Um, and again, we'll spend more time on this. So let's, let's go to, why don't you just, let me show you how to save it. So scroll down. So let's say that was our template and, and actually where did it go? Actually, and then delete all this bottom part, delete, delete all that. Yeah. Just X out, hit the X, hit the, hit the, hit. Yeah. Hover over them, hit the other X. Let's save that other one. Just, just, just for, for, for practice, but you can delete that one. You can, um, and then down there. Yeah. X out of that one, no empty spaces. Perfect. And then X out those social media icons on the bottom or any one of them actually. Um, and then, and then you can, you can either X out of that one. And then now you can go to the top. So scroll up to the top. So, so there's, there's your social media icons at the top. Perfect. And then your logo. So hover over the logo one and then hit the pencil, hit the pink. Yeah. So right here, I can upload an image of my logo and then I can even put a URL. I can link it somewhere, which is what I do is I'll just put a simple logo um, in Canva, for example, make a simple little, or maybe even just put my name or my signature in Canva and then use that and then link it to my, in my case, I'll link it to my YouTube channel. In your case, you can link it to your calendar, right? So, so we'll definitely play around with this, you know, much, much more. But let's say, for example, that's our template. We have everything optimized. We have our logo. We have our social media icons already connected um, and all that. So scroll down and let's say now we want to save it. So hit save as template. And now I saved it and I can use that same template over and over and over again. So X out, hit the X at the top, and I'll show you where that where that save template is at. So now over to the left, my templates, the pink heart. So if you click on that, that's where your template is at. So now on your second email, your third email, your fourth email, you can just continue to click, drag, click, drag, drag and drop, drag and drop, drag and drop, and just use the same one. Obviously you'll reword the text because every email is going to say something different, obviously. Yeah, but it's all the same style. Yes. At least I have the same style. I have my icons. I have my logo. I have my button. Like I have everything the same. <clears throat> and I'll just do little tweaks here and there. Okay. So this part, the email sequence. So scroll up to the top. Let's, let's, let's um, hit edit, hit the green one. That's how you save it. So you hit the edit and then, and then boom, it's saved. And now we go back to the settings part, this little dashboard part, and then we'll X out of that part as well. So yeah, so now it brought us back here and then we'll just close out and then now it just brings us back to to the um to all the other emails. So this part right here this could be this could be the time this could be time consuming this this part right here. But what I always stress is the fact that this it's worth it. Heck yeah, like this is your back end. Like once that lead comes in your world, you got to do it once. You yeah. got to do it once. And now these people can continue to hear from you over and over and over and over and it's like and, and while you're sleeping, while you're out with your daughter, while you're chasing your cat, you know, around the freaking house, you know, so you don't break the blinds, like <laughs> these emails are automatically going out. And, and if we can properly optimize each one, which really optimizing, what I mean by that is having the damn calendar link in each email, what's going to happen is as long as we're consistent, putting people through the funnel, which is consistent. What I mean by that is by running ads, as long as we're filling the funnel, you're going to have a ton of people that all live down the street that are receiving these emails on your behalf, which equals waking up every morning and appointments are on your calendar. That's, that's where we're trying to, that's what we're shooting for. That's the ultimate goal. I want to wake up to appointments every day. And I, I and I didn't do one damn thing about it. Like I didn't want, I didn't do one thing to, to, to make it happen except for this, obviously, like yeah. we set it up one time and then now appointments are coming through consistently. You know, so so this is the back end, and this is where I see every agent drop the ball. Yes, you may run a Facebook ad. Yes, you may capture a lead, but that's where it normally stops. This is where is is what most people you know miss is that back end, that nurturing of the lead. Well, uh, yeah, 
that follow up. Yes. And, and having a calendar link, calendar link in each email that's optimized. So, so, so we'll get back to this part, but if you scroll down, you got one email, you got two emails, you got three emails that are set to go out every other day. So, so there's a good start right there. So we're going to spend some time going into each one and editing each one to really fit the Nikki, you know, personality and, and making sure that the templates are, 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 are looking good. Um, but okay. that part, and, and here's what I do real quick before we, we hit done and exit at the top. What I do here, because here's a handful, right? Here's a handful of emails just to start playing around with. Just to let you know my schedule and, and really how I do it is, is I'll come in here and I'll set up these emails real quick. But, but to stay consistent, what I do is I allocate an hour a week. So I'll put aside an hour a week, one hour a week, where I come in here and I add three more emails. Next week, I'll spend another hour. I'll come in here. I'll add three more emails. You keep, you stay consistent. You keep doing that before you know it, you're going to have 57 emails laid out. And so if you can imagine like a person comes to my funnel, they opt in. It's like, holy cow, I don't have to worry about that lead for a long time because every other day or every two days, they're going to hear from me. That's automation. And so I have some funnels where they'll get an email from me every other day for freaking ever. Cause I have some sequences where I have like literally 80 plus emails set up because all I did for the past, I've been on Karcher since 2018. So if you can imagine how many emails I was able to set up every week, like all I do is add a few more, add a few more every week, add a few more, add a few more. And the damn thing doesn't end, you know? So that's what you eventually want to do is, is, is put a little bit of time a week and just add a few more, add a few more, add a few more. And, 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 and that's when that, that's, that's going to build that brand and build that consistency where people are like, holy cow, this chick keeps hitting me up. Let me talk to her, you know? So, so that, that's going to be powerful. So hit done and exit. We'll get back to this part for sure. Done and exit. That's how you save and come out. So that's, that's my communications, right? So now click on my pages to the left, my pages. Now you have these four pages. That's what came over. So on our next call, we'll spend time and we'll come in here and we'll optimize the pages. We'll change out the, the image of the property. We'll change out the yellow button. Whatever our, our, our color is, we'll go with that one color. We'll change out the headline. Um, and that's all basic editing. In fact, I think that part's even easier than the emails. But um, all the pages are there. So if you just hover over any of them and click on preview, you can see... Um, and that's, that's just, that was th this page right here that you're clicking on. So click the, the eyeball. This page is the actual video sales page. That's, that's the section I showed you earlier. That's all that is, is a simple headline, a video, a button, the logo, that's it. And that, that would, that's an example. The reason why I sent it over with you is because this template is an example of what you can use in your emails. And so this right here is, is basic, and, but what's so powerful and why these pages are so, so important, because as we set up on our, on our first call, the business manager, as we set up our Facebook pixel, we set up our, we bookmarked, as we bookmarked our Facebook pixel, as we bookmarked our custom audiences, that's what we're going to be able to do over here. We're going to be able to put the pixel on the page. We're going to be able to take the link and set up a custom audience. So as these people are receiving emails from you and clicking and coming over to this page, we're capturing that data, not just on the Karcher side, but on the Facebook ad side. So imagine if I can put everyone who clicked and landed here because I have my Facebook pixel on it and I have that link as a custom audience. Imagine if tomorrow I run an ad to everybody who landed here. Hey guys, this is Nikki. Just wanted to say thank you. I know you've been receiving my emails. Hopefully you're enjoying them. That's a very specific message going out to people who landed on this page. That's a Facebook ad, right? So it's like, now we're going to be able to just really narrow it in and only focus on those that are, that are, that are engaging. And it all happens with these basic pages. So X out of this one, that's a basic email template or an email sequence that I have set up a basic page. And then the thank you page, the call confirm page, and then the seller guide, the opt-in page. So on our next call, we'll spend time and we'll go into each one and edit and, and update it. And, and, and that's kind of our first funnel. Let's focus on that before we even go into the listing funnel or the open house funnel. Let's, we'll focus on the seller guy one and really get that one rocking and rolling. 
So, and then the third one, the third one is my calendar. So we'll spend time on this um, over the next few calls on the calendar to the left, my calendar. So click on that one. And this is your whole calendar. So I already have the template there. All we got to do is click on the three dots and go to the settings and, and, and optimize it. So we click on edit. Now I can come in and I can name the calendar. So give it your own name. Um, I can change out the hours. I can change out. Um, yeah, really, that's what it is. It's changing out the hours, adding a logo to it if, if we want to add a logo. Um, this part's pretty basic as well, but I, I for sure want to spend at least a call um, or actually I went however long we need, but one, I want to, I want to for sure dedicate one call, just, just setting up this part alone, like taking out that inspired digital, putting your logo, changing the blue, um, to your color, you know, and then, um, changing out the schedule, changing out the, the, the registration, all that stuff. So as you hit save and next, it just takes you to the, to the settings of, of setting it all up. But again, I'd love to help you with this part. Okay. So my communications, my pages, my calendars. That's what we'll spend the next few calls on, just really diving into that and setting up those three. And then once we once we have all that set up, then we're ready to, to really start rolling out. Okay, and I have a question. Yes. The seller guide one. Yes. It's actually going to send them a seller guide. I'm assuming I have to attach that somehow. Yes, that's what. That's another thing. That's the last part. Yeah, that I that I meant is is meant to say is, is not only do we got to set this all up too, but we got to definitely get get our hands on a seller guide. Now I have a ton of them that I'm going to send you here once we're done. That that are all they're all my other clients. They're all different examples, but they're 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 examples. So you'll be able to see these different seller guides. And so I have a video where I'm teaching you how to get your own done. So if you don't have one done, you can spend like, you can, you could take these examples that I'm going to show you. You can spend like 20 bucks and get someone to redesign it for you and rebrand it, put your face, put your contact information and use the, the thing about these seller guides. They're all the same. I have everyone's seller guide. I have Keller Williams. I have everyone's seller guide. They're all the same. All it is is giving information on what it takes to sell and they're beautiful seller guides. So again, I can spend 20 bucks and hire a designer to, to take it and completely redo it to fit my brand. So I have a training video, video that I'm going to send you. And that's kind of what we want to do first as well is not only get all this stuff set up, but yeah, we definitely need to get, get that seller guide done. Okay. Okay. So I'll send you a video on that, but, but to tell you the truth, that's not, that's not the most urgent. The most urgent is, is really setting up all this stuff. The, my communication is the sequence, the, my pages, getting all those pages to match your brand and then setting up this calendar. So you can for sure play around with that um, if you want, but let's, let's, let's for sure schedule our next few calls so I can really help you with that. Okay. Okay. So today's, what's say today's Thursday. So I'll be available, available tomorrow. I'll be available. I'll be available Monday. So just let me know, you know, shoot me a message later on and let me know what time is good either tomorrow or Monday. And then we'll go, we'll go from there. I am free tomorrow. Perfect. You want to do same time? It works for me. Sounds good. I'll send you an email here shortly and then we'll chat tomorrow. Okay. All right, Nikki, you rock. Yeah, thank you so much. I'm super fired up. We'll chat tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Bye.